Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add credit card payments on Magento websites in 2024. Of course, adding credit card payments functionality to your Magento website is essential for any online store. And this tutorial will guide you through the process of setting up the credit card payments using Magento Integrated Payments Provider. Of course, this tutorial is also perfect for those who are just starting with e-commerce or Magento and will help you understand the basics of integrating credit card payment options. So, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you will need to go and log into your Magento admin panel from the dashboard. For example, I'll use this browser for at the moment, which is brave for you. You can use whatever you want. You can simply go to the CRL section, just go and access like Magento and hit the enter button. So as you can see here, even uh, once you click on partner uh, portals example in here. So they even show you as an example uh, that you can uh, accept PayPal and uh, PayPal of course will have the credit card option if you want to do that. So let's just go here to marketplace also. And as you can see in here, Adobe Commerce Results, so insurance program, partner program, training and certification, and boost your product sales with Meta AI powered ad, ad solution, features categories, example, optimize your e-commerce business with payment services, example. So you can click here and get started, example. Uh, of course, make sure to choose uh, Magento open source, uh, Adobe like that, or Magento, click on add to cards, just go and get uh, up or get it in your uh, PC if you still don't have it yet. Once you have it, simply, for me, I'll not download it on my uh, PC for some specific reasons with Adobe. I have some problems with it, so I'll not be able to do it right now. For you, of course, basically, all you need to do is install it and then access your Magento admin panel. Once you log into your Magento admin panel, from the dashboard, you'll have to navigate to the store sections and of course on, you'll find it on the left hand side menu then once you do so you'll be able to click on configuration and their settings and this is where you will configure like various settings for for your store including some payments methods then next you'll have to go to sales tab and click on payments methods there you will see a list of available payments options magento also will support some several payments getaway including paypal uh, I guess they even uh, support like authorize.net and Braintree, I guess. So for this tutorial, as example, you can use PayPal, which is the most known and which is popular as example for its robust features and support like the credit card transactions. So you can click on PayPal to expand the configuration options. And if you don't have like a PayPal account, you will need to create uh, one at their official website. And after, of course, creating your account you can log into it and navigate to the account get the api key or if they ask you for it on magento if they didn't you'll be able to log in into it or to connect into it right away and after entering your information and accessor and logging into it scroll down to the credit card section and enable the credit card payments method by toggling it on and configure any additional settings such as accepted card types uh, payments actions and even fraud prevention measures according to your preferences of course, once you've uh, changed everything, just save your changes. Before going live, it's crucial to test the payment gateway to ensure everything is working correctly. Perform a test transaction using uh, the sandbox, I guess, of PayPal. You can use the test credit card numbers provided by PayPal to simulate some transactions and verify that the transaction process correctly and that you receive the confirmation email. Once you've confirmed that the test transactions are working, disable the send a box to start accepting real payments. Double check all your settings to ensure everything is configured correctly. And your website now ready to accept credit card payments through uh, PayPal, as an example. So to provide you with more like visuals, let's just look for something. So uh, how to add credit card payments on Magento as an example, let's see if we can find an article, something like that. So about this, about this example, and even here is a small video example. So I'll not play the video because of copyright options. So I'll try to 
give you just some insight from it. For example, you'll need to go to your Magento as an example uh, to have this checkout experience. Let's just see. It does not seem like it shows, but it's fine. So let's close that. And as you can see, set up some credit card and debit card. As you can see, they give you even here the option that I said, which is login, go to stores, configurations, go to payments methods, scroll to credit card, use the Moli components. What's that? I don't know. And of course, like uh, if you want to enable that, the mobile uh, call out, okay, so this is for the Moli components. What about like for one click payments, as example, you can go and enable the single click payments under the same uh, settings, etc. Split payments authorization capture example. You can do that also uh, on it if you want to. That example, what's about this article? So, I wish uh, to add a new payments method for credit card. How to add a credit card as a new payments method and my uh, Gento's example. So, pre provide me with a solution to customize the payments methods. As example, like some people are answering here, use this link for creating some custom payments method in Magento 2. As example, the first link in here uh, to get the code and etc. So, as you can see, they show you exactly how to do it in this article. So, make sure to follow it one by one and you will be normally good to go without any problems so yeah basically like that's it so there you have it you've successfully set up now your credit card payments on your magento website using paypal or i guess brain t as i said brain tree and authorize.net whatever you choose and this feature will help you boost sales and provide some seamless checkout experience for your customers so you keep exploring other magento and like uh, Braintree, PayPal uh, features to further enhance your store functionality. So stay tuned for more tutorials and happy selling 2024. And I'll catch you in the next video. So goodbye.